if your ex was a people pleaser and they had a hard time saying no to friends, family, work, etc., watch this video. Hey, what's up? I'm Coach Benny and I help people get their exes back. And for five years before I did this, I was a dating coach and I had to pay a lot of attention to how to create attraction to other people. And I use that advice to help you get your ex back. Now, for the people pleaser type, these are usually people that don't have communication skills. A lot of times, these are people that were emotionally neglected by their family or just neglected in general. And because they don't have that emotional bandwidth trained up of going back and forth emotionally with some person that cared about them or was arguing with them or whatever, giving them any kind of attention at all, okay, these kind of people don't know how to ask for what they need or to set boundaries with other people um, and not just in relationships. We're talking about like, you know, it could be friendship or work, etc. Now, what tends to happen in a situation like this is that stress starts to mount. They're spreading themselves really, really thin. And also because they don't have communication skills, they're not solving problems with you in the relationship and problems are starting to build up that they're not addressing. And eventually everything comes crashing down. Maybe grandma dies, maybe they lose a job. Whatever happens, they get overwhelmed from their level of stress and they're going to break up with you as a uh, product of this. When they make up their mind, there's nothing you can do. You can't talk them out of it. They've already checked out of the relationship ahead of time and you're just sort of getting the news broken to you and, and just sort of like dealing with this breakup that's happening out of the blue. Now, if this situation has happened to you, chances are there's some other things that are happening too. Maybe your ex demonstrated the fear of commitment. Anytime it's time to move in, meet friends or family or, or you know get married or whatever, they might have wanted to take a step back. And not all of them are like that, but many of them are. And I'm also willing to bet that your ex is hyper-independent. They like their own time and space. And they also take things as an attack very, very easily. They're, they're very easily defensive. And the reason I can tell you what your ex is like and probably hit most of the marks, if not all of them, is because I get on phone calls with people every single day and I understand the archetypes of which type of people break up with who and for what reasons. Now, if you wanna get your ex back that did this to you, you absolutely can. Yes, you know, they're spreading themselves too thin. Yes, they're people pleasing. Yes, there's a lot of problems at play, but you can reattract your ex and you can get them back. And if you want my help with this process, click into my profile picture, click this link right here, set up a call with me and I wanna hear your story and I'll give you a step-by-step -step plan to get your ex back.